preservation. Or purpose of evasion. Or purpose of evasion. And that I will well and faithfully discharge. And that I will well and faithfully discharge. The duties of the office. The duties of the office. Upon which I am about to enter. Upon which I am about to enter. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations, Mr. Administrator. Congratulations. Congratulations. Hey, Lynn, here, why don't we take a family photograph? Everybody get in? All the administrators I'm pass the press? Okay, there we are. Yes. <laughs> and Mr. Administrator, would you like to say a few words? Yes, I just want to say uh, to have the president and the vice president have this kind of confidence in an old buddy from the Senate is indeed one of the high honors that anyone could have. I want to say that it's a, a new day in space, uh, but we wanted not only my family to be here, but representing uh, the former administrator, Charlie Bolden, General Bolden, eight years under Obama, the former administrator, Jim Bridenstine, four years under Trump, uh, to show the continuity and the bipartisanship with which you run the nation's space program, particularly NASA. And then I want you all also to meet uh, my deputy, yet to be confirmed, but surely to be confirmed, uh, Pam Melroy, an astronaut commander, one of only two women, uh, former test pilot for the Air Force, former DARPA, and this is going to be the team that will be leading uh, NASA. And then, of course, our children who have grown up in this world of politics and government and public service, our son, Bill Jr., and our daughter, Nan Ellen, and, of course, my rock, just like that moon rock. <laughs> My rock, Grace Nelson. So thank you, Madam Vice President. Congratulations, Mr. Administrator, and for all of the work you have done and all that you have dedicated to our country. This is going to be a good time for you to do all that you have done and bring that intelligence and that experience to this position. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you to the whole family. Thank you. And to the past administrators, thank you for your dedication and your work. Couldn't agree more. That this has to be about our nation and what is best for our nation, unencumbered by partisan politics, but based on what we know is the right thing to do and the potential for all that we have. So thank you all. Thank you. Thank you all.